Hey everybody, welcome back to the dome. We're playing on the hardest difficulty. We're playing on the large map. We're doing the automated defenses again. You guys seem to really enjoy that, and I had a good, fun time with that. Uh, but we're going with the orchard gadget to really buff our mining speed and power. So there's a couple of familiar things, and then a couple of unfamiliar things here. Uh, the challenge is going to be uh, making sure that we can keep up with the upgrades, make sure that we can produce water. That's going to be a main focus here, and hopefully we get lucky with our uh, drops and we can find enough to make that happen. Uh, but we're not in control. We're not in control, which is kind of fun. It's an, a neat little way of playing. I would also like to start incorporating more of the uh, assessor into here, and I think that in future runs we'll give that another go. We tried it back in the day when it first launched. But since then, I haven't touched it because I haven't touched the game since then. So, I don't know why I tried to take that. Don't know don't know why I did that. That was suboptimal. Suboptimal play number one. Right there. Excellent. Love that. Love that. Because now i got to take these doodads. Okay. Okay. Oh, nice. That's a nice find, actually. So on the large map, uh, this is going to take us a little bit longer than usual. And uh, that's a little bit of a concern. I'm going to get our probably carry speed next, because we're not far enough to make the regular speed that impactful. Uh, let's just review the orchard real quick. So you plant a tree in the dome that grows fruits to buff your movement and mining power. So this buffs your mining strength, this buffs your move speed, and buff duration cycles 0.35, growth time cycles 1.9. And then we have some upgrades here, so this can last for a longer period of time. Fruit growth speed doubles for cycles, okay. We have the snare roots that come out of this, which is actually not bad. I feel like with this, with this challenge, you don't really want to have things that you need to activate. Um, but this might be cool. A projectile shield? Grow a shield that protects the dome from projectiles. But again, you have to use it in battle, so maybe not. Uh, increases fruit speed boost, letting you move faster. That might be decent there. And then you've got the mining buffs across the bottom. What's this one? Overcharge buffs. Duration, duration. Okay. So, here's the thing. We just have to get we have to get our water under control that's going to be the main thing that we need to focus on and we'll try i'm leaving some space up top there that i probably shouldn't so let's get back to that for any of the ocd viewers right now this is probably driving you crazy not gonna lie me too but as long as i find this stuff i'm cool that makes me happy okay Let's get going. Looks like the uh, the fruit is almost ready. I'm just going to pop a, a regular speed thing here. I think one of the one of the key things that they could do in Dome Keeper uh, long term is to figure out some ways to encourage vastly different um, starting builds. Like right now, you pretty much have to take your your engineer upgrades right away. I can't think of a lot of scenarios where you wouldn't want to be doing that. Oh, nice. This is actually because of the specific blocks that these are in. It kind of feels a little a little bad. Okay, let's climb our way out of here. That was beautifully handled there with the water. The water catch. That was nice. Okay. In here, what do we want? I think we just chill for a second. I could maybe start buffing these. We also have um, this stuff we have to keep in mind. Last time, we went machine gun, I think. Did we go machine gun? I think so. Improved auto cannon. Uh, let's just take that to make sure that we keep our weapons going. Let's eat this. And I'm going to drill straight down here. 
and just try to power farm. Beautiful. I'm going to keep drilling until this runs out. And that is actually quite a significant boost. Okay. Yeah, I, if we can... God, I want to do so many things. I want to do so many things, but we'll have to just wait and see. If we can get that buff to the point where I'm constantly able to use the, uh, the fruit, that would be awesome. But on this hardest difficulty, we're going to need to figure out if that's possible. Okay, what do I have here? I think um, drill strength is decent. Two and four. Mm, Jetpack boost there. I think... Where's the one that's growing? Fruit growth speed doubles for cycles. Use water to overcharge. Oh yeah, this is the overcharge. My bad. That's not really what I want. Yeah, see, I guess I kind of have to go just make them last longer for now. And then probably go into buffing the individual attributes. I don't think I can afford any of these other things at the moment. I feel like the Spire upgrades, if we could get them all, would be really nice, but... All right, let's go off to the right a bit. We'll take that. Oh my God, nice. We'll take this home. Um, carry speed, probably the next thing we need to get. carve a path through here. And then on our next trip up, we might have the fruit as well. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I also want to try not to spend too much time in the menus if I don't have to. Nice. Okay. I know we left some iron over to the right, but this is very, very cool. So if we can get some type of converter, water maker, whatever, I'll prioritize that and then see what other gadgets we get. None of them. Man, I do, I do love a good Drillbert run. You know, I know people love the dinosaurs, okay? But the teleporter, man, the teleporter's so good. It's so good. But until I upgrade it, like I don't have to come back to the dome as often. So maybe, maybe, maybe Drillbert, maybe Drillbert. Let's just pick Drillbert, okay? We're gonna pick Drillbert. Come on, buddy. Let's get you going. I'll let you go uh, this way. There you go. And I'll go back over here. We'll finish this up. That kind of feels like that battle is going on a little bit longer than I would like. It's entirely possible that we just straight up will fail. My gut tells me this is deeper than I need to be here, but with the larger map size, it is a little harder to gauge as well. I'll just dig this all out. Okay, let's go home. We'll eat that fruit. We'll be down here in no time. That's another thing, too. Like, having the teleporter would mean that when you get your fruit buffs, you're immediately using them instead of spending time going down and, uh, and using up some of that fruit buff time just on travel. Okay, let's let that feed in there. Can I take a... Can I take a... 
heavy bullets buff here. Let's do that. And then we'll use our next eight on carry strength. And then seed and see you later. Bye. Oh, nice. Let's just keep drilling here. Oh, wow. This is sick. I feel like this this is what we want to be doing to take advantage of all the uh, all of the buff from the fruit. Let's go ahead and take this. Can I squeeze these in too? Yeah, this seals all right. That's fine. And then we've got a couple of other things chilling down here for our next trip. Um, I probably want to go into being able to do dome repairs, although it seems like that wave went super well. I'm judging just by the, the speed. Okay. Blast mining or probe? Really? These are the options? I mean... I could shred, but that feels bad. I guess I'm going to go probe here. Right? I guess I guess so. Let's show the health meter. The wave warner. Hostile proximity meter. Mm, I don't think that matters, really. The exit route doesn't really matter. So I think just getting to automatic repair would be good. Just so it's, like, fully something I don't need to think about. Impact recuperation could be all right. Let's go ahead and take one of those. And then I'm on three and two here. Um, still haven't buffed any fruit like I would like to have. Let's do a speed up here of the auto cannon, I think. And let's go. So I'll dig slightly out this way. Okay, we found something there. Okay, Drilly, I'm gonna try to just bring him to the edge here. The edge is somewhere. Huh. And we'll have him just dig across this way. Okay, so now I've <laughs> I've got a bunch of stuff like all over the place. What did that do? What did that do? Is this a new, uh... Whoa! He's helping me! What is that? I have an octopus helper? That is so cool. He's just gonna go and, like, find random stuff to bring home, maybe? He is definitely bringing it home. That's a sick hole right there. Um... Let's take an orchard, uh, a buff here. Effects of the fruit last longer. And... Man, I just realized... I, I don't have space for any converters or anything now. I don't have any of that. This is going to make this way more challenging. Okay, that's incredible. I did not expect that we would have a helper like that. Ooh. 
See, even with the buff, I feel like that's a little deep. So what I'm going to do is we'll use some of our extra speed here to just carry. Although it feels like... I don't know. That feels like suboptimal, if I'm being honest. I'm carrying a lot here, but... Let's go... I'll see if I can blast something down here. I don't know. The probe kind of feels like one of the one of the worst upgrades to me. But here I am, living the probe life. It's okay though, I got a cool little octopus friend. And a dinosaur that I have to take care of. I mean, we found that thing pretty early. So over the course of this run, if he brings back, like, 50 things, like, that's pretty massive. I would think. I'll take my uh, speed boost here. Um, I gotta make sure that... Now that I don't have a way to produce water, even though I said that was going to be one of our main things, here I am. Uh, I need to make sure that these go into our weapons first. So we'll finish up the shotgun. And I should probably put one into the autonomous repairs as well. I do have a lot of stuff just chilling here right now, so... Okay, nothing in this area. That's gonna take me too long to cut through. I'm gonna cut this. Actually, I'll do one more. And then I'll get him going this way. There you go. Grab the rest of this stuff. I feel like I may have left some stuff on that left side too, but... Okay, so with that, I think I can finish this, 10 and 4. Now, um, I don't have the automatic repairs yet, and I need this as well. So let me pop one in here, then our next six go to health, and then we go automatic repairs. I guess I... Yeah, I feel like I should have definitely... Um, should have shredded that in hindsight it's a large map so maybe I have more than enough in terms of uh, other gadget opportunities Drillbert my dude Yeah, I caught you. Not like the path that he's on is going to be that important for me, but... I feel like this is going to be a very difficult win. If, if it's a win at all, to be clear. Okay, so we're going to go here. Then I need to grab some water somewhere. Which is going to be a problem. <laughs> Nice.
We're gonna need a drill boost here soon. Oh wow, sick. Okay, so we have some things to the right of this location, deep down. I think I can grab this one as well. Keep an eye on the health. there. Ooh, dang. Prospecting meter is sick. I love that. The lift... <laughs> the lift would be kind of nice, because then I almost never need to come back here, except to, like, bring... Uh, to hit the orchard, you know? Um, we did do the prospecting meter recently. I think I'm going to take the lift. The downside is, like, I just have so many things that need to be upgraded that I literally can't upgrade because of the water situation. Um, we are on a large map, yes, so there, in theory, should be more water. Gonna drill this out a little bit. We know we have some stuff to the left here from that scan. Let's just pop another one here. Okay, nice. Yeah, I definitely need drill strength, and then we need to probably buff the um, stun laser. There's a couple interesting uh, schools of thought regarding this automation challenge because I know for some uh, part of the part of the enjoyment is to see, you know, fight like the the, the monsters fighting. You know, like that's that's fun. Uh, but on the other side, like, doing all of this stuff is actually pretty fun as well. Let's go drilling here. Uh... Okay. They're handling it. They're handling it. I also feel like because we have the probe, there's less incentive for me to to pick up that prospecting meter because it's kind of like overkill. Oh, you did not get scanned. Must have been just out of range there. Beautiful water. Give me two. Nice. Thank you. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is... I'm just like flying right now. I gotta get Drillbird awake. I'll see if there's anything off to this side. Nice. <laughs> okay, we found the mother load here. Now, I should maybe consider... Okay, right on cue. Drillbert found some water there that I'm gonna leave in case we find... in case we find a seed. Uh, you know what? I'll drill right through here. We do have the auto repairs now. I can't remember if I need to leave more room.
four roots, or if that one is good enough. So maybe if I can have enough discipline, I'll tr I'll try my best to um, to only go to the top when my my seed thing is ready. I'm gonna check in here. My mining patterns are leaving a lot to be desired. Okay. Thanks. Oh, it's a little much. Okay, so I need to go up with this. And then we'll see where we're at. Sounds like some scary stuff hitting the dome here. Eighteen and one. All right. I know we have a bunch down there, so it's okay. But let's go into firing stamina a bit here. And then I'm going to take max drill strength. I know it's a bit overzealous. Maybe I should take this. Yeah, let's take that. Let's go impact recuperation maxed. And then I'll take... Let's take uh, carry strength here. Okay, I mean, that thing's got the damage. It's got the damage, so... That's sick. I'm gonna actually use this time to drill. I think. Let's just see how deep this can go. Nice, we got a little cluster here, that's a bonus. Wow, okay, so that's the bottom of that. Hello. Oh my god, that is excellent. Now there's more of these because we're on the hardest difficulty and or it's because we're on a larger map, so there's gonna be I think three. I'll come in. Well, actually, if I just grab this. Now I've got a teleporter. That's sick. Let's see if I can ping any water spots here. Zero. Ouch. I'm gonna take this. It's a little messy, it kind of pushes some of our stuff out. Which is annoying. Okay, we have tons of cobalt. We do have three water chilling in here. Um, let's use these for the laser. Area stun. Think is good. Maybe just more stamina, stun strength. 
area damage too. Let's try going into the area stuff. So we'll do area stun, area stun two. And then that's about it for right now. Refill this. Peace out. We gotta go find Drillbert. Beautiful. I'll actually carry these with me. Okay, he's found something up there, so that's good. This looks like a single thing. It's either water. Oh, it's not. Just was at the edge of the deal. Okay, so the seed's ready. Teleport's ready. I'm gonna leave that. I'm okay if this one breaks. Dome's getting absolutely hammered on, it seems. Okay. Okay. Let's prioritize the weapons still. We'll go firing stamina here once that gets counted. And I'm going to take... Just short for drill strength. That's fine. Wake up our buddy here. This is fine. More water. Now, I know I just should focus on that right side, but I, we have a ton of stuff over here. That... I do not want to leave. So let's just get this all to the middle. Give me something. Bidding. Nothing. Okay. Ugh, right on the edge again. Hello. I'll take it, man. I'll take it. Okay, so after this, there's some things on that left side. There's a few things in the bottom right. How much cobalt do I have here? Actually, I don't know. Prospecting or shred? I mean, to get to this where it's detecting water and stuff is going to take too much. So I'm going to I'm going to shred. Okay, I have eight. So that's good. Let's take the uh, drilling here. Oh, I did not want to set that teleport there. Rip. Okay, let's get back to this area here and just kind of feel out what's happening. So we've already been down here, which means that must be going for quite a while. Anything? Holy smokes, man. There we go. Found the big boy. Okay. 
Looks like he's got a line going directly here. Nice. And then... Looks like it's going diagonal. Hello. That wasn't too bad. What am I missing? What am I missing here? They're all on. Are they not? Looks like power's flowing in. Huh. What the frick is happening? I don't know exactly what's going on there. Let me take a recharge here. Okay, that one's definitely on. Could it be that there's another one over here? Because that one's coming up like direct, but. Nice. Holy smokes. Yeah, oh, okay, there it is. There's another one. Got it. Four of them. Let's leave that. I want to take as many of the uh, special deposits back as we can. So I might just do a little quick cleanup here. We'll grab these. And then we get that health refilled from the bomb. 32 and 8. Okay. I mean, all things considered, it's not too bad. Firing stamina 3. Let's choose this. And then... I wonder if I should get some spire upgrades. Maybe, maybe I try to finish as much of this as possible. Area damage, and then area damage two. I think more damage, more better. Uh, speed there. And I've got 21 left. So I'll drive this back over. I didn't activate him. My bad. Do we have any other things sitting in here? I don't think we have any special resources sitting in here. Alright. 
So I'll do a ping south. This doesn't feel very pingable. I might actually be like as low as we really want to go too. Like I think this might actually be the bottom. Ish. Okay, that could be water. Nope. There is uh, water on the left side though, because I left some for uh, a potential tree spot. So I'm gonna go dig that out. And I'll totally 100% remember where it is, obviously. I can carry most of this. This seems fine. Okay. Where are we at? We have 12 cobalt. That, I mean, hey man. Crazier things have happened. I just feel like without some of these active abilities, um, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough, but based on the decisions that I made, which were ultimately suboptimal here, um, we're going to have a tougher time. The stun blast grows bigger with every new monster entering it. That's kind of cool. Let's do this and this. So we're only going to be missing these two. Um, we've got 12 iron, or sorry, 12 cobalt, 27 iron. Can't upgrade any of these things. Okay. I think we just go get the bomb now because besides keeper upgrades, there's nothing. Unless I miraculously find more water. But you know what? All things considered, and for um, not having a way to generate water, I think we're in actually in a decent spot for our upgrades. So I'm kind of okay with it. And we'll just see what happens. Oh, that guy stole it. All right. It's all up to you. Now we have uh, no upgrades in the spire. So all of these projectiles coming in are just gonna hit. Oh yeah, we are probably screwed. cobalt do I have left here? None. <laughs> I mean, still a solid, still a solid run. I didn't get presented with any of the conversion options, uh, but instead of taking Drillbert, I should probably have shredded. Uh, or instead of taking the probe, I should probably have shredded. I feel like the probe is fine. The prospector, I think, is better, but even both of them are not as necessary. Prospector's probably got the slight edge. Um, but yeah, I definitely didn't need Drillbert. I should have shredded. I should have shredded. I should not, what I should, the key thing is that I shouldn't have taken up both of my seller slots. Okay. That said, you asked for it. We handled it. Um, we just, you need to have a water. You need to have water happening. So that's the key. Anyways, that was fun. We probably won't do an automated run again, just to kind of keep things a little fresher. Uh, the orchard buff was super, super nice for that. Um, I really enjoyed it. Mm, let me know what you guys want to do here. 
I'll turn off, whoops, we'll turn off uh, automation. Uh, we'll probably stick to you asked for it, maybe go to a medium size, uh, since there's more that I'm gonna have to manage. And in terms of gadgets or keepers, I know you, you guys probably wanna see the assessor a little bit more. It would be something fun for me to kind of learn how to use efficiently. And uh, it might be a bit of a struggle, so maybe we have to maybe we have to try it on on brutal. But let me know what you guys think. And uh, we used to have this thing where you guys would submit challenges, and then I would do the challenges. And sometimes they were successful, sometimes they were not. But that was fun. So if you have creative ideas, let me know, and we'll go from there. Okay, bye now.